on the banks of the Kishwaukee River. We're in DeKalb, Illinois, where the crowd is pumped up for this exciting college football matchup. Hi, Brad Nessler in the booth, along with former quarterback Kirk Herbstreet. And we'll have reports from Aaron Andrews. Today's game is brought to you by Spark, because better athletes make better football players. Our matchup is between the Iowa Hawkeyes and the Northern Illinois Huskies. And here come the Huskies. We're looking forward to another great matchup here early in the college football season. For Iowa, their passing game's going up against a premier shutdown corner. It could be a quiet day for him. I just don't see them throwing in his direction, covering a pretty poor wideout. Kickoff's just ahead, but first let's head to midfield for the coin toss. Brought to you by Spark, because better athletes make better football players. Both teams are lining up for the kickoff, and we're just about set to get this one underway. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. For Northern Illinois, give us a sense of how their offense works. Well, it's a lone back set with a quarterback and a shotgun, so it's a fairly fast-paced offense. And the possibility for some quick, big plays is very real. But they rely on the run a good deal to keep things balanced. What a great run for a huge gain and a first down. I can't say enough good things about this guy. He's been making runs like this throughout his entire college career. It's first and 10. Ball on the 45-yard line. Here's a run. And there's a penalty on the play. Let's see who it's on. Holding. 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 On the on the Holding penalties can Still really kill down. momentum. But sometimes if you don't hold, your quarterback can take a pretty good shot. So first down once again, but a long ways to go after that penalty. They go with the run. At the 30, to the 20, to the 10, and he will score. You love to have a home run threat like him in the backfield. Every time he touches the ball, he's capable of tearing one off like that. And he tacks on the extra point. A quick two-play, 77-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. And it was really those long runs that really helped propel that drive. So our score, 7 nothing. Stovall, ready to kick. And this is just a booming kick. And this one's going to come back to the 20. They'll start this drive at the 20. Got his tight end open and he drops it. 
makes it second, second and ten. And ten. Second and ten. Ball on their own 20. They go with the back, and he's got room. Harrison gets six yards on the carry. Here's third down. Four yards to go. Ball on their own 26. It's getting louder down on the field. Let's go! Black and five! Black and five! And he's immediately tackled. Well defended, but it's complete for good yardage. Just a risky throw here by the quarterback. You cannot keep tossing it up into the secondary like that and expect your guy to come down with it every time. The defense is going to jump on one of those and take it the other way. From their own 40-yard line, first down. Here we go. Black 55. Black 55. Black. Nice run, and he's brought down. A gain of about four yards on the draw. That'll make it second and seven. Second down and seven coming up here. Ball on the 44. They go with the back, and he's got room. He gets out to about the 44-yard line. From the 44-yard line, it's first down. And he makes it out to about the 41-yard line. Harrison is a bit shaken up, but it looks like we could see him back on the field soon. It's second and seven. Ball on the 41. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Luke gets seven yards on the play. We've got third down and one. This is the eighth play of this drive. And it's going to be hard even to hear the snap count. This place is hopping. Mays running the option. Tackled for a loss. That's not going to keep the drive going. Good, solid defense there to force them into a fourth down situation. Looks like they're going to go for it on fourth down. The Huskies take a timeout, and they'll have two remaining. It's fourth down, and they're going to try to go for it. Mays back to throw. It's caught, but they're not going to make it. And there's a missed opportunity by the offense. The offense will take over at the 34. First and 10. They're packed in tight on the line. Tackled after a decent run up the gut. Stovall gained seven yards on that play. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. 
They line up in the jumbo set. Stovall, again. He's got everybody beat. Inside the 30. He's got an opening. He's all the way. Touchdown. The defense might as well have just waved goodbye, folks. There's a lot to like about this guy, but what I love is that he's not satisfied with just getting first downs. Every time he touches a ball, he's looking to take it all the way. When you combine that mentality with great talent, you've got yourself an All-American. And he adds the extra point. A quick two-play, 66-yard drive, and the result, seven points. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. That can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. So the score now, 14, nothing. He really got a hold of that kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. from their own 20-yard line. It's first down. And he's tackled after positive yardage. So they get five yards there on the halfback draw. From their own 25-yard line. Second down. And he's level at the 31-yard line. So they gain six yards on the play and pick up the first down. Heads up play by the quarterback to find his receiver in traffic and get the ball into his hands. From their own 31-yard line. First down. Here's the give. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. Luke gains around eight yards on the run. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Tackle made at the 48. From the 48 yard line, first down. Luke takes the toss left. He makes his way out to about the 35. The defense doesn't seem to have an answer right now. They might need to change up some of their schemes. First and ten. Ball on the 35. They go with a run, and he's brought down in the backfield. Well, these days, you've got safeties playing up close to the line of scrimmage, almost like a fourth linebacker. The only way that you can keep them from cheating up is to take some chances downfield. Second and 13 coming up here. Ball on the 38-yard line. On the handoff. Watch out. He gets to about the 27-yard line.
Third and a couple. Ball on the 27. Runs outside for a nice game. So he got enough for the first down there. Yep, nice call to run the ball there on third down. I like it. First and ten. This is the ninth play of this drive. Luke, again. That's a great tackle at the 14-yard line. A gain of eight on the carry. That makes it second and two. Tenth play of the drive. It's second down. Luke on the run. And that sets them up with a first and goal. So another run and another first down. Now it's time for the defense to buckle down. They need to start hitting the gaps and getting into the backfield. First and goal, and they need a touchdown here to get back in this game. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. They bring him down in the backfield. That'll bring it in to the first quarter of action. The count here at Husky Stadium is Northern Illinois, 14, Iowa, nothing. Second down, six yards stand between them and six points. They put everyone up on the line. On the run. Touchdown, Iowa! Strong run by the halfback to get into the end zone. He's a pretty sure bet to get six when you're this close to the end zone. And he hits the PAT. So a 12-play, 80-yard drive. And that's good for a touchdown. The score now, 14-7. Iowa to kick. He got all of that one. And they can forget about returning this one. The offense will take over at the 20. First down, 10 yards to go. They're packed in tight on the line. Here we go. Cut. And he's tackled at the 49-yard line. Perfect time for the play-action pass. Well, here the defense is looking for the run, and the play-action put them in even a worse position. They just weren't ready for the pass there. From their own 49-yard line, it's first down. Northern Illinois up seven points. And he hits him hard at the 27. There was good pressure coming in, but he stood his ground and found his teammate for a nice game. From the 27-yard line, first down. Oh. 
catches it. He's tackled at the 11-yard line. Well, the defensive backs completely jumped the run. Only the run was never there. It was just that misstep that allowed the completion. First down, they're 10 yards away. Here we go. They'll throw on first down. Got him. And he goes down quickly. Austin gains four yards on that reception. That makes it second and six. It's second down on the six going in. And they got him for a loss. The defense was playing run all the way right there, and it paid off for him. It's third down, only seven yards from a touchdown. They line up in the jumbo set. They give it to the halfback, and he's tackled right away. Well, they tried to keep it on the ground for the first down. You know, Brad, here the defense just steps up and makes a play, stopping them and bringing up fourth down. And it's the offense that takes the field on fourth down. Let's see if they try to pound it in here. Both teams have their goal line sets on the field. And for Stovall, he's got a second rushing touchdown. He's run the ball very well, and he's going to see a lot more carries before this one's over. He's really helped carry the offense so far today. And he adds the extra point. So that's a seven-play, 81-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. So our score, 21-7. Sends it sailing downfield. And this one's going to come back to the 20. They'll start this drive at the 20. First down, 10 yards to go. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Here's the halfback. He makes his way to about the 32. From their own 32-yard line, first down. Decides to slide. The quarterback thought he saw a little bit of running room, but he made a good decision to get down in a hurry. Second down and seven. Ball on their own 35. Throws falling back and got his man. And he's taken down at the 36. Maybe got two feet on the play. Nice grab there by the tailback to at least move the ball forward for some positive yards. It's third down and seven to go. Ball on the 36-yard line. They give it to the running back and not much there. Luke comes away with two yards on the carry. It's fourth down. The punter comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. Oh, excellent punt. The offense will take over at the seven. They're packed in tight on the line. 
He might have a chance. Nobody's gonna get him. The 50 at the 40, inside the 30. He scores, what a play. And for Stovall, his good day just became a great day with his third touchdown. You've heard the saying, a guy's in a zone. Right now, this guy's not stopping for anybody. And he tacks on the extra point. Stobo has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep. Taken at the five. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. They'll start at the 26. Here's a draw. He gets to about the 34-yard line. They show pass and then hand it to the back for a pickup of eight yards. From their own 34-yard line, second down. It's complete. Tackle at the 47. A part of any quarterback's arsenal should be the ability to sell the run with a good fake. He does a really good job here on the fake, and then they pick up some nice yards. First and 10. Ball on their own 47. Throws off balance incomplete. Well, he didn't lead him enough on that pass. Well, he tried a little too much finesse on that pass, I think. He needs to get a little bit more velocity on it. That way, you don't have to lead the receiver so much. And he's tackled right away. From the 38 yard line, it's first down. Luke gets it on the inside. And he tackles him hard at the 23-yard line. They've obviously found a formula for moving the ball against this defense. Let's see if any adjustments are made before their backs are really against the wall. From the 23-yard line, first down. On the ground with a tailback. And he makes it out to about the 21-yard line. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. And that was the junior corner who will get credit with that tackle. From the 21-yard line, second down. Anderson gets the call again. Up the middle for a nice game. Tailback picked up seven on the draw. Here's the eighth play of the series. Luke again. Touchdown, Iowa! And for Luke, he reaches 100 yards on the ground. 
The game plan they devised has been working fantastically, and nowhere has that been more evident than in the rushing number. And he converts the extra point. It was an eight-play, 73-yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. So our score, 28-14. Iowa. Iowa, ready to kick this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And this one's going to come back to the 20. And for Stovall, he's had a lot of success running the ball today. Well, you're right, Brad. And this guy's kind of the spark plug of this offense. And right now, he's got him firing on all cylinders. And really, all this kid needs is just a little bit of daylight, and he's a threat to take it to the house every touch. This offense has given the fans a lot to cheer about. Can they deliver more? They'll set up shop at the 20-yard line. They're packed in tight on the line. Gets the pitch. He's got a block. He's got the corner. He's got an opening. At the 40. At the 30. To the 20. To the 10. Touchdown! And for Stovall, that carry lifts his rushing total to over 200 yards for the game. Seems like from the first snap, he's been flying down the field. It's like the whole game's been one big play for him. And he hits the PAT. Stovall looks ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. No chance for a return. It'll come out to the 20. The offense will take over at the 20. First and 10. Great concentration. The Hawkeyes call a timeout, and they'll have two remaining. From their own 31-yard line, first down. Caught open field. He's knocked out of bounds at the 41-yard line. That makes it first and ten. It's first and 10. Ball on the 41-yard line. First down, look at the throw. There's a flag down in the backfield, but I didn't see what happened. Personal foul. Personal foul. Roughing the pass. Roughing the pass. The officials have gotten really serious about hits like this. I think it's good for the game that they're doing such a good job of protecting the quarterbacks. From the 44-yard line, first down. And he's hit immediately. Iowa takes a timeout. That was their second timeout. They line up for another first and ten, and they're really on a roll this drive. Pass right, running backs got it. Luke picks him up around seven yards with that catch. Chucks it deep down the right side. Knocked down, incomplete. The safety comes up with a nice play. Nice job of the safety here, sitting back and playing center field, and then seeing the ball and coming up and simply batting the ball away. 
They'll throw for the first. Good open field tackle. Anderson gains seven yards with a catch there. They just continue to impress as they keep working the ball down the field. Oh, and he had some steam on that throw. Nice play to set up first and goal. As we've seen before, they go with a hurry-up offense. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. We've got a flag down on the field. Might have been offsides. Offsides on the defense. First down. First down. So with the half ending, they're just going to try to put three points up on the board. And it's through the uprights. They might just want to squib this one. Only a few seconds left here before halftime. Nice kick, plenty of distance. No chance for a return. It'll come out to the 20. The offense will take over at the 20-yard line. They come out in a goal line set. Stovall takes a pitch. He steps out at the 25. And that'll do it for the first half. Still plenty of football to be played. The count here at Husky Stadium is Northern Illinois, 35, Iowa, 17.